That would not be good because I don't have a rope on this. So what I'm doing now, um, I'm trying to remove as much shells because there's shells in the carburetor. Oh my god. How is this thing running? Oh shit. There's, oh my god. The whole carburetor is covered in shells. Literally. Look at that side. I'm gonna try to get some of that. Oh, we got some of the reeds in here. I don't know if you guys can see on the spark plugs, but those are shells. And hopefully, I'm gonna see what I could do. And hopefully, this thing will run back again. Oh, it wants to start.
Who wants this? Approximately 10 hours later. Alright. Go boiling. Oh my god, how hot is this? Alright, so I didn't realize that it's almost 5 and I have to be somewhere at 5. So I'm not going to replace the impeller, I'm just going to go straight to the dock. It's about a, a mile run. Hopefully it doesn't lock up, but we have no impeller. So we'll see how she goes. I'll just use water and just pour it on the cylinder. We'll see how far we get. Hopefully we make it all the way. So I just came back from the boat ramp. Um, basically, I'm just gonna put an impeller in this thing. Um, I do wanna check the compression because I'm really curious uh, what the compression is on this motor. Just clean it up, uh, put the impeller in, and I'm actually gonna put this boat back in the water and I'm gonna go grab some food with it. Um, so I'm just gonna do somewhat a tune-up on this engine. All right, so I have my gauge in. Um, it's in a top cylinder. I'm gonna put the camera down because I don't have anyone here to record it while I'm pulling the full cord. So I'll let you guys know what the top cylinder comes out. So this is the top cylinder. It's 120 PSI on the top one. So I just did a compression check on the bottom cylinder and <clears throat> It's literally the same um, compression, 120. And if you guys don't believe me, I'm not sure what to tell you. It's literally 120 and 120 um, pounds of compression on each cylinder, which is crazy. I'm gonna put her back in the water. I can't believe it's running still. All right, guys. So the boat is back in the water. Um, motor runs really good. It's pumping great water. It's really flat out. No wind. I'm um, gonna go for a little cruise and I might put the drone up. But we're gonna go to, to a restaurant on the water. We're gonna take this thing. Gators. My boat is parked right there. 
and I'm still running the same engine that I abused today and I'll tell you what, she runs really good still. Not a single issue with it. So I just ate, we're gonna head home slowly. Motor runs great, like I said before. I'm really surprised that it actually still runs with good compression. I'm really impressed um, what it actually did today. And if it, if it did impress you, then I'm not sure what to tell you. But that little 15 Yamaha is really reliable for what it is. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.